Mexico will not pay for the fucking wall. Hola, Donald. It is me, Vicente, coming to you from Mexico, where the best taco balls are made. Actually, this are shit. They are not even Mexican. Why is the ball made out of tortilla? Just eat a fucking taco. As the former president of Mexico, I want to speak directly to you, the current president of the Electoral College of the United States, because we need to get something straight between our two countries. And it isn't going to be a fucking wall. Don't know. Under no circumstances will we pay for this stupid, useless, racist monument. I know when you came up with the idea, all the experts thought it would work. But the bad hombres have gotten more sophisticated since then. They are even sharing plans on the internet. Look at this schematic I downloaded from the dark web. It is a ladder, Einstein. You're going to build a $25 billion wall that can be defeated by a $25 ladder? Be honest, Donald. This wall isn't going to stop anyone who really wants to cross the border. It is just going to make your country weaker and poorer and less respected by the rest of the world. Now that you know the world won't work, you can use the money for something else, like this water. For $25 billion, you could provide clean drinking water to the entire of the planet for three years. Isn't that a better legacy than a pointless wall of hate? Of course, I know you are not a big water guy because you're always drinking Diet Coke, which, by the way, is not working. So here are some other options for the 25 billion. You could end world hunger for one year. You could hire 50,000 teachers for a decade or pay for the college education of 250,000 students. And look at this design specifications you put out. The wall must be at least 18 feet tall, 6 feet deep, and look pleasing from the American side. Donald, come on, man. What would be the point of us paying for something beautiful if we cannot even see it? That would be like marrying a model who won't even sleep in the same city as you. Cute kid, huh? You know who that is? It is you. Before you turn into you, Donald, instead of building a wall, build a bridge across the oceans of time and walk back across it to find this small boy and tell him that just because his father doesn't love him doesn't mean he cannot love the world. Well, I have to get going. I have a busy day of not being hated by the vast majority of my country. Das Vidania, camarade.